None of this can take place without the support of the community uh, in which we operate, uh, both small and large. And so we'd like to thank uh, Mayor Obrist uh, of Monmouth, Mayor McArdle of Independence, and Representative Paul Evans. I saw Paul here, Paul. Oh, there he is, right there, Paul Evans. Uh, we can't do this. The university can't function without that kind of uh, public and political support, and we really appreciate all of their efforts. We wouldn't be here today without the actual work that goes into building the building. And so for, with that, we'd like to acknowledge and thank Malam Architectures, Anderson Construction, and our own staff of our own physical plant. All of you have done such a great job in bringing this together. Well, good afternoon, President Fuller, members of the Western Oregon University Governing Board, and everyone else who's gathered here today. I have visited schools across the state, and one thing is very, very clear. Students are engaged and excited about learning when they have qu high-quality teachers. And the educators who are trained on this campus and in this center will one day contribute to our state's goal of building a seamless system of education and helping students at every single level so that they can graduate from high school with a plan for their future. Western Oregon University has more than a hundred year history of preparing teachers. The College of Education produces the second largest number of new teachers in the state. And 80% of school districts employ your alumni as teachers and administrators. Congratulations. <laughs> Together with Western Oregon's university's partnership, I am very confident we can move our state forward and build an education system that meets the needs of all of our students. Thank you and congratulations on this fabulous success today. We continue to adapt to the needs of our students and to the professional communities we serve. Our programs have expanded to include American Sign Language and interpreting, rehabilitation and mental health counseling, exercise science, community health education, and many educator programs, certificates, and endorsements. Today we celebrate all that is great about Western in the Richard Woodcock Education Center. Access, affordability, collaboration of ideas, Oregon wood products, and technology, and most importantly, the faculty, staff, and students who call Western in the College of Education home. It is an honor to have my name associated with such a beautiful and state-of-the-art building. For example, could you ever imagine walking around with a marking pen, washable of course, and writing on any wall that has been painted? Now, I think that's one of the um, uh, most unusual things that struck me today. <laughs> This structure will facilitate and amplify the quality of interaction between mentors and learners. Let us not forget that the impact from these interactions is not limited to that day or to a week or even to the school year. The effects from this interaction may well have their impact 20 or 30 years down the line in a student's career. Modern physical facilities such as this building are calculated to uh, and result in more and better interactions with mentors, also helping the student achieve success in later life and career. And thank you. <laughs>